Hi, in this tutorial, I will explain how we can create a macro which will delete all the lines whenever there is a condition which is meeting. I have some data here. Now, in this data, I have serial number, city, and state. Now, let me apply one filter and in column C, I want to select any state let's say I'm selecting this state highlighting this data now I want to delete all the rows wherever we have a state as Uttar Pradesh now I how I can do that so let's see how we can develop a macro for this task what I will do, I will go to developer tab here, click on insert from active X control, select one button. I will drag a small button here. Then I will double click on this button so that I can write some code on the click command of this button. So my first line, let me copy some code which I have already developed to find the last filled line so this line this is a variable last row equal to this workbook dot worksheets sheet one is the sheet name and rows dot count one dot and excel up dot row so this line tells that what is the last line filled with value basis on the first column let me minimize this we can see here that 28th is the last line now next line is I want to run my macro from last line to second line so I will use a loop for i equal to last row to to step by minus one so that it should run one by one next now condition is if in column c we have uttar pradesh then i want to delete the line so this is the condition for that I will use if this workbook dot worksheet sheet name is sheet one dot cells row I and column is C that means third column dot value equal to Pradesh then rows I will pass I delete and I will close this if a statement so this is the entire code to delete data whenever there is a condition which is meeting in this case, whenever I have value as Uttar Pradesh, I want to delete that line. Now, once the task would be done, I would say worksheet first row and first column cell one dot seven I'll close this window I have written my code this should work for the requirement now on the command button I will select design mode again so that my button is out of design mode now if I click here this macro should work 
see so this is how we can automate simple macro or some small requirement using easy code thank you